Hello friends, in this video, we are going to see how we can create a basic QT creator application to implement computer graphics practical. So to create a computer graphics practical using QT creator application, we have to first open QT creator. After opening QT creator, you will be see uh, this welcome page of QT creator. In that welcome page, you will have to navigate towards the create project button located to the left top corner of the window. Click on the create project, then select QT widgets application from the dialog box, then choose, then give name to your project. So I will give is name as basic. Let's see. CG, basic CG. You can navigate through this browse button to save your folder at your preferred location. I will keep this the default location, which I already said and click on next, then next. Then in the class information window, you just need to check that all the classes are present here. For example, main window, main window.h, main window.cpp, main window.ui, then click on next, then click on next. Then this is the important section where you have to select the kit selection. So in, the, in this section, please make sure that the desktop Qt 6.4.1 is checked while you create your application in Qt Creator, then click on next Then finish. Now Qt will create a basic uh, Windows desktop application for you using the C++ programming language. Now Qt will build all the files and index them. So this is what the basic code given by Qt Creator. It will list all the files. Okay, it has configured all the files. Now it will pass the files. Now it has indexed all the files. So in the basic Qt creator application, you will be seen header files, source files. So inside header files, you will be get <laughs> this main window.h file, which is a header file containing all the declarations of the class main window. Then main.cpp is the starting or entry point for our application. And main window.cpp is the file where we will write our all the code. Then main window.ui is the file uh, where Qt Creator provides us a form layout which we can design using the design tool provided by Qt Creator. So to implement computer graphics program in Qt Creator, we will need a canvas where we can draw various shapes and objects. So first of all, we will make design for our application. So uh, we for that, we have to navigate to the main window.ui then inside you will be seen a widget box at the top left corner of the window. Then search for label. Then drag and drop, drop that label. Then edit the properties of label, the geometry of label from the properties tab present at the right of the window. Give x, y coordinate as zero, width as 500, height as 500. The label will be of size 500 by 500. Now we will draw a line on the label after clicking a button. So we'll, we will add a button here. So for that search for push button in the widgets box and drag and drop the button. We will redeem the, it as a line. Okay. So we have designed it successfully now. I will change its name as canvas. Now we will try to run this basic program what appears on the window. So to run our program, we have to go to this run button located to the left corner of the window. Click on that run or else you can press shortcut control plus R. Now the project is building and it will show the output. 
So this is what we have created until now. We have added a button and here is a label name canvas. Now we have to replace the label name with an image object for that we will attach an image object and after clicking a draw line, we will have a program which will draw a line in that canvas. For that, close the window. Now head towards minwindow.cpp. Inside, declare an object of type. You image img then img will is a constructor which will have width as 500 pixel and height as 500 pixel then you image format underscore so format underscore bgr8 so it will give background color of black to the window now we we have to set up this <clears throat> black color image to the label for that we have to target the ui label as so target the elements i again repeat target the all elements such as label button present in this ui we have to select that elements from our main window.cpp we will given a ui object so we will use this ui then ui label then on this label, we have to attach this image for that UI label, set pix map, set pix map. And we have to create a Q pix map. Q pix map from image. And we have to pass the IMG object over here. So this basically this line of code does, it attaches the images which we have created here which is of 500 width and 500 height of color black on the label and creates a program. So now we will be appearing a black box. If we run the program, so the black canvas is appear here. Now we will be adding a click listener on this button to draw a line on that image. For that, I will go to the UI, then right click on this button then select this go to slot then select the event as click event as of we have to uh, handle the click event okay then here the code will appear automatically in the main window.cpp now we have to draw a line so for drawing a line i am creating here a for loop for int i equals to 100 comma i is smaller than equals to 250 comma i plus plus inside the loop set a method as img dot set pixel so the x coordinate of the line will be i and y coordinate of the line will be 100 which is remain constant and then the color of the line will be qrgb 0 comma 255 comma 0 which will be green in color okay now this code will draw a horizontal line starting from the x coordinate 0 and y coordinate uh, starting from x coordinate 100 and y coordinate also 100 with the color of green up to y coordinate on 250. Now let's make it as 350. So the line will be bigger. <clears throat> now again we have to call this method here to display the line. Okay, now we will run the program. So now my program should work like this. When I will click the draw line button, a line should be get drawn. If I click a line draw line button over here, a line is drawn. So this was the simple program where we see how we can create a simple computer graphics program using the Qt Creators Windows application. Thank you for the video.